All right, welcome back. Sorry about the phone calls. Okay, Twilight, what did you have in mind? She's lying! Well, that much is obvious. She's trying to deceive all of us. She wants us to think that there's this other unicorn out there who wants all this power, but I know she's lying. Trixie has never shared power or secrets with any pony before. It's, it's all just an act. She knows if she can gain our trust, she can still get her hooves on that amulet. Okay, Twilight, slow down. It makes sense. She sent her evil shadow to get rid of the princesses. <gasps> Maybe she's going to interrogate them herself into revealing the location of the amulet. Princess Leskia told me the magic in the amulet isn't safe for any pony. Pegasus, Unicorn, Alicorn, even her! Then she won't get her hooves on it. Don't worry, Twily. Cadence and I won't let her near the amulet. I agree that the amulet needs to be protected at all costs, but... Are we really sure Trixie is behind all of this? What if she's telling the truth? Trixie's never told the truth. She's lied and cheated and conned her way into getting everything she wants. She has the princesses. I'm sure of it. I won't let her out of my sight until she takes me to them. When this is all over, I want Princess Celestia to throw her in the same dungeon cell that she tried to keep me. Twilight, this doesn't sound like you at all. I think she's right, dear. Trixie shouldn't go unpunished for what she has done. No pony hurts my little sister and gets away with it. Cadence, I've been quiet this whole time. Do you know how hard it was for me to do that? Ever since Princess Luna was taken, I knew I would have to keep my mouth shut. I needed time to think, to come up with a plan, and make sure I'm right. Not to mention, I didn't want her out of my sight again. I've had to sit back and listen to her drone on about all her problems and all these lies. I can't take it anymore. <sighs> she stole my body, my identity, and left me in a cell to rot, taunting me. I've never seen a phony so cruel. Not even offering my friendship could stop her or change her mind. She's evil. She's always been evil. I think you're speaking out of hurt. The Twilight I know would have several theories to explore, not just one. Especially since there's a lot of evidence to consider. But all the evidence does point to her. And I expected to believe that the Shadow Alicorn just happened to show up after Princess Luna and I confronted her? There are no other theories that I need to have, Cadence. Trixie is the one behind it all. Then what do you suggest we do? I want to catch her in the act. I want to expose her lies right here, right now. I think we should give her an amulet and see what she tries to do with it. We can't just hand over the Alicorn amulet, Twily. Not the real one, a fake one. If she thinks she has it, maybe she'll reveal what she plans to do with it and where the princesses are. I just need to see it so that I can make a copy. Princess Celestia told me never to retrieve the amulet unless instructed by her to do so. But if we don't, we might not be able to find her or Princess Luna. I... I don't like it. I've never disobeyed Celestia before. It is... for the best, honey. We'll be careful, I promise. <sighs> I hope you're right, Twilight. I really do. Man, I've never seen Twilight get really, uh, really overreacted to, to Ka Princess Cadence and sh shining armor before. Sister, are you alright? I am in good health, if that is what you mean. What did she tell you? Are you insinuating that you actually care about what I think? Luna, you have to understand, I, I only did what I thought was best for you. Best for who, Celestia? For me? I just thought. Yes, Celestia, you thought. You make the decisions for yourself and for me, apparently. You've made that quite clear. If you're worried about where my allegiance lies, you can rest easy, sister. I have not turned against you. You didn't Luna. join her plight? I have not given her my answer. She has given me time to reflect on my choices. Please, let me explain. You had a millennium to do so, sister. So did he. He? Shadow. The mom 
monstrous alicorn beast that follows Estelle? How do you know of this creature? Your omnipotence fails you again, dear sister. Do you really think you are the only one between us to live with regrets all these years? You are not the only one to keep secrets. And regrets. Wow. Oh man, that was, that was awesome song, but this feels, that was so sad. Uh, we'll continue this one at the next part. Uh, see you later.